Will the Shannon button work on God's strongest white woman jump scare? Let's find out. No. Or, yes, crap! There is no meme. This is just a threat. Hey! Welcome back to Fire Emblem 4 Sub Run! Fantastic level up there, Shannon. Thank you. You really done did it. And now the Discord moderator has to take away his kitten. And we can complete the map proper. I think. Those aren't goons with Fenrir up there, are there? No. Yes. Yes. Alright, as long as I don't move anyone too far up... For the, uh... The Fenrir... I should be completely fine. Oh, Finn can just come up and kill this guy, can he? Unless he doesn't double, but I'm fairly certain Fenrir makes you have, like, negative a million attack speed. Nice. Wow, Finn's almost max level. That's a good level up to have. Alright. Um, where is the dancer? She's over here. Okay. So we don't want to move up too far right out of the gate on account of the th of a third of a second Fenrir hitting the tower so we're gonna play back a bit and then kind of just smooth people up I guess Daisy will just go for those villages to the right yeah sure that sounds about correct We'll just use a quick fortify. I don't think anyone's really hurt. But now they're definitely not. Tristan. Alright. We should be able to proceed to the final nightmare. Which is Arvis. And getting to Paulmark and the children in time. Pretty sure... There won't be too much of a problem. I think. Who knows? God might still abandon me yet. I definitely could have moved Rottlebon up farther. It doesn't matter. None of this matters. I'm probably preparing for Fenrir too much, and, like, I'll never be in any remote danger. Only Fey can go up here. Alright. Come on, Fenrir. Do your worst. Oh, you're targeting Shannon. What do you have, like a 5% hit chance? Oh! Literally nothing. Wow. Remarkable, sir. Masterful gambit. Does this guy even have a... What's his name? Zagam? That is an incredibly dumb name. So Shannon can just kill him. Leaf can just kill him. Um, Dimna? Can Dimna? Dimna can kill this first Fenrir guy. No, he yes he can. He'll double. So sure, let's just do that. Bam. Bam. Followed by, in no uncertain terms, BAM. Okay, um... Let's make sure that Fee gets the... the magic ring from here. And I guess she can hold on to it for a little bit for the flame sword, though I highly doubt that's gonna get anywhere. Celio can start moving up. I think it'll take one more turn to kill this mofo. Maybe. Am I at the point where I'm still trying to divide around experience points? Not really. Whoever gets it, gets it at this point. 
We're all mid-twenties, except Daisy, whose opinions don't matter. So, it, it, we'll just win. Um, I guess Selif would be nice. 35... Doubled. Yeah, you won't... That Silver Sword is near critical. Hmm. Um, where can you get to? Hmm. No, Tristan can do a drive-by. Besiege, Brave Sword. Hehe, <laughs> you've been cursed with such a poor shot, your mouth. Oh. Well, you know what? It was my plan from the start to give that kill to Tristan. I felt as though he truly deserved it. He was... Actually, with that level up, I'm more than okay giving that to Tristan. And Finn, simply because no one else is going to get it. Perfect. With that taken care of, Selif, we're good to go. The kids are gone! Oh no! Wherever will they be? Surely they're not going to be on this way out of bumfuck nowhere peninsula. That's not what a peninsula is, that's literally just a shore. Anyways, I don't remember if you necessarily need to send a flyer over there. I like, I think it just helps. Alright. So where's where Hawk is currently standing? is where I'll need to put, um, Lelia. So, just finish getting everyone ready, and then we can play Fire Emblem Engage. Let's see, Hannibal right there, Rottlebond right there, Mana right there, um, Amid right here, and then we'll do a little dance. Make a little love, and then quite possibly even get down tonight. Um, you go right there, you go right there, you go right here. Your placement and things don't particularly matter. Oh, you can heal up Charlo! Excellent. And then Jean, Jan, the bitch from Bayonetta. Alright. We're good? We're good. Chalfi. Um, yep. There's Paulmark. Um, where's Paulmark in Fire Emblem Heroes, you know? He's the real MVP. Okay, right. You don't necessarily need to send flyers over there, but it definitely helps. You need to be quick. I don't remember, does Paulmark even have a weapon? Well, he has the T-Fring, Typhring. He has the thing. Yeah, you definitely need to hurry. Alright. Femina! I might have made it so that you're not really going to see any combat. And that was a little dumb of me. Bottom text. Um, yeah, we have authority star, authority stars, and authority stars. Thankfully, most of these units can and will be killed with a proper, um, proper, where was I going with that? My brain is lost. Right, counterattacks. So, to start us off, I can put Dimna right here, armed with the Brave Bow, and then I can press for an offensive from there. 
Um, what's smarter? Sending Altena over there to kill them all? I think that might actually be the smarter play. Um, yeah. We'll do that. And then everyone will rally behind Dimna. Yes. And with our powers combined, maybe, just maybe, we can kill them all. Or at the very least, most of them. Tristan right here. Um, Ares right there. This is a bit of a tricky part. Not too much, but a little bit. I actually quite like this chapter. Like, now that I'm replaying it again, I have to wonder if it is my favorite chapter in the game. Because its objectives and how it plays is very cool. I guess the problem is the first bit isn't that interesting. It's just a bunch of shamans in the middle of some woods. Um, Jan getting yet another flawless level up. Alright. Um, Yohalvir... Uh, Rottlebon can go up there. You can go over to here. Uh, Mana. You go right there. Amid. Alright. And then we dance. do do Okay. After about... 11 minutes of pussyfooting around... It is time to actually engage... In some strategy. Oh, Daisy. Daisy, 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 Daisy. Daisy. Go get that money, girl. And then give it to... I don't know. Alright. Dimna should pull off the sweep on these armor units. Yep. I think... Yeah. Barely, but yes. He needs all four shots. Because Fire Emblem 4 said, yes, generic enemies with 70 health, please. I... That's my own mistake. Yeah, I should not have put all of them right there. That, that was dumb of me. Alright, but then the big armor guy also moves up. Yes, okay. Eliminating him is, like, instantly eliminating. Let's just let them all move up. Uh-huh. Okay. What is your... You just have a men's staff. Alright, we're gonna have to... We might need to get desperate here. Hit of 114. That... This... This might be a little tricky, but if we put Altena right here with the Javelin? Oh no. Okay, now we're good. And then we'll have to worry about the repercussions of that later. Does this... Oh, this doesn't kill? This does, this does. I, I can do math. Alright, so, but good job, Dimna. You took down two of them. You've opened up the path forward. Your level up was absolute dookie. But I can live with that. Yohalvir will not kill. Or, I think he, he should proc a cost here, right? I'm pretty sure he procs a cost. If he doesn't, this will just be another notch on the I don't understand how a cost works. You know what, maybe for that reason I shouldn't do that. Do you have an armor slayer? You just have the uh, silver sword. Um, Rottlebon with the brave sword, 37. So 37 minus 19. Yeah, that's not going to be enough. Let's just use Hawk. Uh, yeah, that'll work. Behold! The power of God's triangle! 
Behold it again! Perfect. Yeah, I forgot that these arch- like, these armors are actually very tanky. Turns out giving an armor, uh, 70 health? Does make them quite beefy. I mean, what do I really have to lose? Alright, so a cost didn't activate. I really don't know how the hell that skill works. Someone's explained it to me, I still don't fully understand. Um... Shucks. Um... I can't rely on adept proccing for you. So... Hang on here. What's your move again? Nine. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine. I have to move someone else. Alright, you know what? Attack, silver sword. You wouldn't kill even with the silver sword. If you even double, which you would double. Okay, that's that's fine. Um, I guess Tristan, then. <laughs> Attack. Oh, wait, hang on. Never mind, never mind, never mind. Hang on. I can do this. Steel sword. You're just doing damage. And this is purely so Linda, armed with the power of... Elf Thunder, I guess? Yes, exactly, Elf Thunder. We'll just remove this guy as a concept. Excellent. Now, the next thing we need to do... ...is kill that commander... ...with, um... ...Ares, I guess? I don't think the Armor Slayer is... The Armor Slayer is going to be 64... Actually, the Armor Slayer might be enough... Let me, let me look at this. So that's going to be 26 times 2. So that's going to be 31. That's not going to be enough. Um, Ares will just have to be the one. Yep. Which is fine. It's not like Ares isn't literally created. Okay. Fine. No, this is fine. This is a roughly normal thing that people have to deal with. Okay, thank you. Oife. Now Leaf can go up. Oh yeah, he doesn't have nearly enough magic for that to work. Sure, maybe he'll proc critical. Thank you. Apparently, Leaf is the only bitch a man can trust. Which, like, it's fine. Totally fine. I'm not at all in any way, like, salty about these developments. Um, Tristan... Brave sword, and then back the hell up. Unless you proc critical, which will be enough, I think. No, it's not. But you have left it wide open for Seleph. Which is good. Attack, silver sword. Yep, that'll do. I mean, the problem's more so going to be that now... Uh, well, hold on. Let's just use Charlo, Staff, they, uh, Fortify? I could Berserk someone. But I don't know who. 
So I think I just won't. Where's Charlo? Yeah, for now. Berserk is a useful tool. But I'll worry about what I do after the fact. Mm, and sell it right there will mean that only one do like if this armor moves up, he's the only one that's going to be able to attack him. You can talk to him. You can talk here? Right, this is um Oife saying, "Hey, the fatherland, it is near." Noish, Alec, I just sorry, every time I see this, I get angry that Arden's name isn't among who Oife mentions. Alright. Anyways, really good talk to Selif and Oife. Both their characters are good. Who just got a bajillion health? And by a bajillion, I really just mean three, but that's a bajillion by my metric. Alright. You go up there. You go up here and dance! Celio, Old Rottledon Bottledon. Imagining this map, if I had Femina, Femina wouldn't have done too much here. She might have killed someone, which definitely would have been helpful. Alright, wait. Daisy! Go make bank, girlfriend. Alright! This can very easily go incredibly wrong. Alright. Oife has a pretty good chance to dodge with uh, Selif standing right there. That also takes one dude off of... Oh, okay. Ow. Okay. That Great Knight is not really going to have a significant chance to hurt anyone because he's just probably gonna miss the problem is leaf might take too many attacks or the secret third thing that's that altena can't survive as well as i think she can putting oife there might have been the unintentionally smartest thing i could have done Wait, the Light Brand has Weapon Triangle advantage over you. Why are you attacking Leaf instead of Seleth? You know what? Don't question FE4AI. It exists to love you and be merciful. And I will accept its love for who it is. You know, the thing that's going to make me lose is going to be like Altena just dies to, uh, the two Yermungan users. Probably. I'm willing to assume you're putting, um, Leaf to sleep, I assume. Yep! Thank you for doing that at the end of everything. Greatly appreciated. Yeah, well. Um, you yeah, know, Ares has resistance, so that's fine. Let's see how this goes. Oh, no, she dies here. I did not realize their hit would be that high. It's because I was looking at her avoid when she has the gay bulge equipped, and that increases her speed exponentially. Alright! Fuck. Well, at least I know the strategy to do on the left. I'm really gonna struggle saving these children, I think. So I learned that Altena just has horrible avoid against these guys. And that there was nothing I could do from the start. So, basically, I don't know how to stop this. 
Also, there's this going on. But I feel as though that's a little bit less of a problem. Restore on Leaf. A point of magic would be nice. Strength. You got strength. Sure. I guess that's not a problem at all. But, okay. We have slain that goober. More luck and not speed. Love to see it. And, uh... I mean, I guess we'll just have him go. Oh, God. God dang it. Okay, no, that'll be fine. It'll be fine, and other hilarious lies you can tell yourself. So who are the commanders? That's one of the commanders. Okay. I want to kill him! And what better way to kill something than Ares? As we have very constantly established. Unless, you know, you're some kind of double pavicing general. If you're that, you can suck my dick. Skill and speed, that's good, that's good. So we have eliminated one of the commanders. The only one left has decided to fuck off over there. And Leaf will probably be the one to provide a messy end to his sorry life. With all the commanders out of the way, Washington is without a football team. Joke for no one that... The, my target demographic does not care. Okay. Um. Rottlebon? Go up here with the Brave Sword. I'm pretty sure you have this made. Barely, but yes. I just realized they're level capped. Huh. Uh huh. Then Shannon can go up here, and he will look at... I don't know, this guy? No, this guy. I have chosen you at random. May God have mercy on your soul. I mean, technically speaking, over on the east, the only one that I need to live is Paulmark. The others, I would like them to live. But it's not exactly any skin off my nose if they don't. Where is my dancer? Alright. She is capable of making... Said... And others move again. Which is huge! Very huge. Riveting times will be happening in the said moving again department. Alright. A mid could probably proc adept, but we're gonna play it safe. 40 kills on Elwind. That's funny. Um, Linda, who I have actually damaged in between, like, through the other cut is now more than capable of probably using her magic to just remove this, uh... Wait, what? I used Fortify with Charlo. I used Fortify with Charlo, and I forgot... Oh my god, that's... That's hilarious. I specifically had her at half health, and then forgot I used Fortify with Charlo, which took her out of Wrath range. That, I don't know if that's funny or tragic. Kind of both. God was popping off when he made triangles. Really, really good shape. Really good shape. Okay, so, with that mistake now rectified, we should... Keyword being should be fine at this point. 
Um... Who do I need to kill here? Hey, you know what? Hannibal! Show me what you can cook! Nice! Yeah, killing off the... The, uh... Excuse me. The two mages will be the best usage of my time. Or no, these two. The mages can live. I'm not too worried about what they're capable of. Um, old Finnegan? Can give him the old stab. Excellent work. Oife. Armor Slayer. Will this do enough? Oh, no. That's not good. That is actually quite bad. Never mind. Salvation comes from the most unlikely sources. Physic, physic, physic. Cool. I'll just massacre you openly and without regret. Daisy! A terrifying man is Julius. Yep, I am well aware of that. <laughs> then Acelio can continue to do nothing. Yes, queen. Okay. For the most part, we're good. The only problem is going to be how I save the Tifring. Tifring. Oh, and the innocent children or what is Hawk really your best target? Like really. Well, you know what? You do oh, you got to live. I guess that's why. But there were multiple characters you could have attacked that just couldn't counterattack you at all. And plus, there's the fact that Hawk can just proc Adept. Which means, what are you doing? Well, I guess all of them will heal him. Okay, good for you. So is that one going farther ahead just to jump scare me? Well, regardless, next time, we can save the children. Hopefully. Maybe. The children might all die. Happy Thanksgiving, everyone.